What's going on guys? It's Steve with AUE Lending and today you're watching our very first episode of our weekly uh, video blog that is going out to all of our real estate partners where basically we let them know about something in the market that's uh, different, uh, some success stories that we had, recent fundings, and the idea is just to share some uh, valuable structuring of deals that might be able to help one of your clients. Um, today we're going to talk specifically about a bank statement deal and how it could be useful. Um, keep watching. Okay, so let's jump right in. So we have a client that's um, maybe he was shopping for a house, maybe not, but bottom line is he found a house that he really wanted and he wanted to buy it. However, when he was going through the pre-approval process, he real, realized that his uh, income conventionally could not, um, could not absorb because he already had two houses and he's self-employed. Um, yes, he's a trainer, he's, uh, he's making a pretty good living. I looked at his tax returns, I realized that you know, you, you, uh, although you are self-employed, um, you are still showing enough net income to qualify for your own house. However, when you plug into the calculation the other two properties that he had, and that's a whole different story because obviously he had two properties that were uh, listed on the market and he wanted to buy a new one, sell those. In the perfect world, you sell them, you get the cash, and then you go shopping. But as you all know, that's not uh, how it works most of the time, where we have clients that might find something on Redfin, Zillow, or you might have uh, showed it to them, and they really like the property. And then the challenge is like, wow, I wanna buy this. However, I have a mortgage. In this case, he had two other mortgages. Both those properties were listed. And then what did we do? So we looked at his tax returns. I look at it. I see that the gross income is pretty significantly. Like in a year, if you average it out, he does gross a good amount of money every month. However, after the expenses, the income is just unfortunately not enough to qualify for three houses. And I think most people would be in the same situation. It's not easy to qualify for one mortgage now, let alone three. So using the bank statement deal, banks are calculating income a lot more aggressively, guys. They could multiply it by two, three, sometimes four times more than a client that could qualify conventionally. In this case, we did the underwriting. We realized that, you know what, conventionally you could qualify for only one mortgage, meaning you have to sell those before you find something bank statement deal, I was able to squeeze out a lot more income for him and then he was able to qualify for two out of the three houses. Um, and that was the challenge. That was the challenge. He went into escrow on the house that he wanted. He made it contingent on the sale of one of his properties. And then the other one we were able to convert into a rental during the process. And yeah, so we, uh, we closed the deal for him recently. His interest rate was not that high. I mean, as you know, rates are going up now. But for a bank statement deal, uh, we were able to lock him in on the six and a half. Now it's a little bit more higher, but the bottom line is it is possible. And then now he's uh, selling the other property. Once he sells it, uh, another thing, the loan I got him was an interest only 10 year loan, which works kind of like a line of credit. When he does sell his property, he could dump or he could put a large amount of his down payment into his mortgage and then they would recalculate his payments and the rate still stays the same. This is a, this is a really good program for a self-employed person that has flexibility and wants to control exact how much of the principal they want to pay into their mortgage every month. Guys, hit like, subscribe to the channel. We are gonna be doing this more often. And then if you're on our list already, we wanna say thank you so much for following and we're looking forward to working together.